Hello everybody, it's Peter. It's Friday. I'm in Chorleywood. It's a place in the Chorleywood House Estate at a place called Chorleywood Lawn Cemetery. Now, not a lot going on in this field, but in this, it's all memorials and flowers galore. Perhaps galore is the wrong, wrong word, but. Um, a lot of people are remembered. A lot of the phrases are always in our thoughts, remembered with love. Beloved mother and grandmother, uh, the dates of their lives. Brenda and me, possibly. Uh, wife, mother, grandmother, great grandmother, loved and remembered always. A lot of, a lot of that sort of thing. A, a great variety of different flowers. People are imaginative. Some two, there are two sets of flowers over there and there's a whole sea of flowers on recent, well, these aren't graves, perhaps, perhaps they do, um, perhaps if people have been cremated the ashes are buried beneath these plaques. I just don't know. But this part of the field is completely un, unused empty yet but this one is filling up fast i think i prefer the yellow the lilies to any other flower but um, it's all subjective but the the uh <laughs> please don't please don't write and complain um here's a bench for mick tucker 1947 to 2002, remembered by Sweet Fans Everywhere. Sweet Fans? There was a band called The Sweet. I wonder if Mick Tucker was in it. He died at the age of 55, 2002. Uh, I wonder what they were famous for. I just don't know. But um, maybe, maybe he was famous. Um, this for this chap, Russell Philip Stewart Brett Rick. Not sure what the Rick, why Rick. 1938, 2014. Wonderful husband, father, and grandpa. Much loved and missed by all his family and friends. Remembered for fun, for the fun and laughter. I like that. I like people to be remembered for positive, good, and enjoyable things. Um, Here's loving, loving memory of Maureen Scard, Mo, 1934, 2015, so she was 81. Dearly loved mother, grandmother, always in our thoughts. Hmm. There's, that looks like a sort of fresh, almost like a grave. Let's have a look at this one. Don't know why it's been dug over. In loving memory of Anthony William Stratton, Muck, Murtry. 1929 to 2022. Loving memory, Sally McMurtry. Much loved wife, mother, grandmother, and great grandmother. Uh, similar dates, but a bit uh, a bit younger. So <laughs> I'm sure there are a sound, well, hundreds of stories here about these people, um, and it's important that they are remembered. But it seems to me that almost every plaque has got a bunch of flowers attached to it, which is rather nice. A um, bit of personal information. My relatives for the last, I don't know, 50 odd years have all been cremated uh, with, with some kind of uh, symbol, like a, perhaps a memorial on a bush or something which after a, a decade or so gets replaced by someone else's. So I haven't got any graves I can visit, but uh, I don't mind that um, because they are always in my thoughts for fun and laughter, as one of the signs says. There's a helicopter going by and I'm going to see if I can get out of this this end of the garden, I don't think I can. Looks like a water fountain or a 
or is it uh, um, a, a, a sign? What do you call those things? Um, <laughs> which shows uh, what the time is. Um, hmm. Not much use when the sun's not out. So there we are. Um, interesting display of memories. You can almost feel, almost sense the souls here. Remembered. Um, there you go. Thanks a lot for watching. Cheers.